Hello everybody and welcome back uh, to Permadeath Lobotomy. Alrighty, in this episode we have a few things that we need to do. Obviously, we're trying to get as far as we possibly can before we all die. <laughs> so, all in all. I think we're looking pretty good. Um, now, obviously, a lot of people are level 1, which is not so good. But, um, considering we currently have 15 people, 5 of which are in reserve, I'd say we're, you know, at least somewhat solid. Um, now, that being said, we can lose someone literally at the drop of a hat, or the slightest lapse in concentration. So, yeah. Especially when we have bravery. Cause, uh, <laughs> one thing that, you know, we do one attachment work and suddenly dead. Yeah, that's pretty good. <laughs> so, yeah. Well. We basically just need to be as safe as possible, and we just need Joy to sit on um, crumbling armor until we're able to get rid of the gift. Once we're able to get rid of the gift, um, we really don't need to worry about him much anymore. However, uh, there is still the case of the whole Quiploth meltdown thing. Yeah, that, that's going to be a little bit of a problem, but uh, you know, I guess we'll just see what happens. Oh boy, okay. So, we need to figure out what he does. He's, lo he's looking uh, pretty pretty spooked. So, um, let's give it a go. Um, yeah, that was a bit close. That was a little bit close. <coughs> that was a little bit close. <laughs> what is our health? Oh, it's... Oh, it's zero. Okay. <laughs> okay. Yeah, okay. We'll just, we'll just have her go heal. Okay. 80 freak no 85 temperance and she barely did three boxes 85 temperance three freaking boxes are you kidding me she's like our best person she literally has the highest temperance here. If she can't do it, who the heck is going to be able to? Oh my... <laughs> this is so stupid. We're literally already dead. I, I, oh. <laughs> and he's probably going to bust out and be a stupid chimera, dumb, scorpion tail form thing. Oh. The, uh, are we already gonna lose a bunch of people? It sure feels like it. It really feels like we're about to lose a lot of people. Oh, good. What the heck are we supposed to do? If attachment doesn't do it. Instinct? Maybe? Insight? Winsight? Maybe it's even repression. I don't know. I, I really couldn't tell you. Um. Let's. Oh. <sighs> Sally has so much more health than him, and she still almost died. Do we try justice? 
Because Temperance didn't work. That was a total flop. Um... I, we could technically send Joy. I don't know how much I like that idea, though. Ugh. Whoever we send, it's gonna... Uh, I, I guess it should be Sally, right? She's got the highest stats. She even has the highest justice. Oh, man. Alright, we might be losing Sally. Oh! This is almost exactly like Mao. Wow! How about that? Oh, please be repression. <laughs> oh, no! Oh, Sally. <laughs> oh, god dang it. Oh, man. Oh. That sucks for multiple reasons. Oh, that sucks for multiple reasons, man. Okay. So it's not attachment, it's not repression. Instinct, I guess? It's gotta be one of them. It's gotta be one of them. Everett, you're up. Oh my god. You're kidding! <sighs> wow. Um, so we just can't work on this, and he's absolutely gonna break out? What does he need? What do you need? I, I... Ugh. Oh, God, that's... That's like multiple days of farming just down the freaking drain. And we lost Sally. That's why you split up your XP gain a little bit more, boys. That's why you split it up a bit more. I guarantee you, he's gonna bust out if a Quiploff counter happens, too. He's obviously an HE. I... Do we sacrifice someone else and try and get a managerial tip? He's only got three. So attachment gave us three. Repression gave us one. Instinct gave us one. So it's gotta be insight, right? It has to be insight. Ugh, God. That is just terrible. <sighs> Ooh, the part of me Oh, part of me is like, oh, this day didn't happen, we'll just restart. But no, that's not the challenge. The challenge isn't, oh, this day sucked, so let's restart. The challenge is, if people die, they stay dead. Insight has a 50% chance if it's level 1. That is still pretty freaking awful. That is still really not good. Do we have? Uh, I, I don't. I, I, um, I don't. I don't, I don't want to set anyone to freaking do it. Who's got the highest red? I mean, technically, Ivanko's got the best chance, fifty-nine percent, and he has um, pretty high red resistance. Alright, buddy. Ivanko, I am trusting you to do 
what Sally and Everett could not. Please don't die. Please do not die. You have Beak. You have a 59% chance. You're actually looking really, really solid here, buddy. You're terrified. That's all right. Great. 59%. 59%, boys! 59%! Does this look like 59% to you? Maybe if he had survived this one, it would have been all green. God. <sighs> that is... Oh, that is mind-numbing. <laughs> it's a good thing I have a little bit more patience than to just give up, but... God dang, if that isn't the most frustrating thing to endure. God dang it. That is so unbelievably frustrating. Because now, no one can work on Red Queen. Nobody is strong enough to work on Red Queen, except maybe Unluckiest Man. Maybe he can work on her, but that's it. That is literally our only option. And we can't send... Okay, Ayn's name was Red. I thought he was freaking dead. I was about to be so upset. Because he literally had no reason to die. Um... Well, you freaking got me. <sighs> Unluckiest man. Work with Punishing Bird. Joy. Work with Crumbling Armor. We need to level up some of our level ones. We seriously need to play catch up now. Um, we need to catch up on literally all stats. Because this Dawn event is also going to probably be one of the hardest Dawn events we're going to encounter. We might lose everybody if we don't play it perfectly. Um, where they spawn? Okay, there's one. We don't... Oh, there's a second one. Okay. Um... Okay, berries, you've got the gun. Then we need people who take a little bit reduced red damage. Um, technically, we could bring Joy to come fight this one, which I think we're actually going to do. Um, and then, yeah, let's see how that goes. Uh, Joy. Oh, okay, you're just taking a second. Alright. Uh, Berries, he's about to come in here, so let's just walk away. Get ready. Start shooting. You take a little bit of reduced damage, so we'll do that. Okay, Berries is really just getting some free damage. I want you to walk this way, just so I can see what your health is. Keep attacking. Berries is taking some damage, so we're going to have him walk away. We're going to have James come in and tank. Okay, keep going. Okay, Joy is fine. Okay, James needs to walk away now. I want Berries to follow. And then I want Marcos. I want you and... Um, who's free? Sambor. I want you to come help. Uh, yeah. There we go. Okay. 
I'm not happy. Very much not happy. Uh, the Heart of Aspiration wouldn't have done too terribly much for us there. Um, yeah, it would have been helpful, but we pretty much had it covered already. Now, what the Heart of Aspiration is going to be literally required for... Right over here. Right over here. It's going to be literally required for that. And we're going to give it to Joy, because at the moment she's our um, heaviest hitter. I don't know what we're going to do for Red Queen. Um, truthfully. I really could not tell you. So, let's send berries up here. And let's have Marcos close behind. And then we're going to try and farm up their stats just a little bit. Um, let's have James come up here. Let's have Joy come down here. Just to change positions a little bit. Okay. Okay, Joy's down here. So, what I want to have happen now... Um, I want someone other than Aen to work on this, as a matter of fact. So, Sombor, come down here. And then once you come down here, we can start working on some other things. So as soon as he gets in this room, we will work on a couple things. Okay. Sombor, I want you in sight. Start walking. That way you can get there and he won't get angry. Joy, come do instinct. And then I want Marcos to do a little bit of insight. And I want James to do a little bit of instinct. Insight and instinct. Yeah, he's gonna bust out now. I don't... I don't even know how we're gonna end the day, if I'm honest. Um, unluckiest man has a 60% chance, and he takes only 0 0.8, but considering it's a Zayn versus a Teth, we'll prop it up to, say, 0 0.9. Joy, I need you to come pick this up. Which also means she cannot work on crumbling armor until she's fought something. Which, uh, I don't think we'll have to wait for very long. Okay, she's got the Heart of Aspiration. She now has a whopping 55 Justice and 84 Health. Oh. Interesting, he doesn't bust out. Hmm. So, now what? Let's just try and end the day, I guess. Because we can't really do much firing at the moment. <sighs> okay. So. Let's have Sambor come do a bit of insight. I'll wait until you're almost there. Okay. And then we'll do Red Queen with Unluckiest Man. Uh, we'll have that happen last, actually. Because ideally we can farm up a little bit. Um, attachment with berries, and instinct with Marcos. Okay, you guys start wandering, and then I want Unluckiest Man to come do this. We got time. We can finish these works, and then we'll just end the day. Sambor's taken a bit too much damage for my liking, but we are still doing okay. Alright, that seems like that's gonna be day eight. <sighs> Wonderful. So, stat-wise, we got Jack and Diddly, so we're not looking very good. We're gonna take the bracelet. The manager of the three letters. A, B, 100, right? <laughs> oh no! Uh, 
Well, why can't we choose 100? That's my favorite letter. <laughs> why not? You want it. <laughs> Listen to me now. B, if you choose to use, remember all the details. Sit down, they are sensible. They have no choice but to be snobbish. But I must lead, not lead to a loss of willpower to make the gains it seems to offer. Personally, I do not like the letter B. This is a new hobby for employees. Not interested. There are no scientific observations for them, but you will be a little lucky if you do during this period experiments. Well, I think maybe. Because if there was a man, it would not be that person. Can you also find a new one for this reason? A new man? Ugh. Okay, well. Looks like we got some new people that need to come in. Hot Simp. Kyle. And then we're gonna make someone special. People have been equipped, and new people have been placed. So, Kyle now resides in the control team. Crimson has now replaced Sally. And in the information team, Hod Simp is the new one. So, <laughs> yeah, that was a pretty catastrophic day. So, what do we do about it? Don't know gonna be honest not even a single clue as to what we're supposed to do against this little putty tat so I guess we just try and farm for as well as that will do um, <laughs> I mm. Is the plan to try and speedrun Hod? Because at this rate, I don't know how much further we're going to get with a bunch of level 1s with a uh, pretty substantially dangerous HE. But I suppose if we made it... I don't know, because even if, even if we get to Hod, we still have to, like, do her meltdown in order to... Um, in order to get everybody at level 3 when we first get them. So I, get, I guess that's technically not a viable... Mm. Well, no. If we have HOD, we can still level up faster. Yeah, maybe we maybe we rush HOD. I don't know. Because Netzack is nice. It is more healing. But I feel like we need the levels more than we need the healing right now. Alright, Dawn of Green. Let us begin the day with a bright and bushy attitude. Um, so you might notice Crimson does look a little bit different than how she does in Ruina. My thinking was, considering this is a uh, Lob Corp Sally, I, in my mind, Crimson has the exact same super poofy hair, but she just did it into two pigtails. That That's the tiny lore. <laughs> Feels like I'm being watched. That's because you are. I'm looking at you. Okay, so. Um, I think we might need to adjust some people around. But the day is going to be relatively simple. Um, as far as this goes, we could just pick this up and put it back down immediately. So that is absolutely no danger to us. We can surprisingly deal with that. Um... So we need someone to sit on Punishing Bird. We ignore this completely. We have Unluckiest Man sit on Red Queen. And then we have two people spam farm on One Sin and Fairy Festival. I think that's a play. <sighs> so... Yeah. <laughs> Let's see how it goes, huh? I'm gonna send Sombor down to deal with Punishing Bird. I'm going to bring... Let's bring Berries up. Uh, and that should be good, relatively, I guess. 
my uh, confidence has drastically dwindled, considering the whole, you know, death thing. Okay, there's berries. So, you're really resistant to red, so Crimson is going to go get some instinct. Sombor is going to... Insight. Well, attachment. And yeah, we'll do insight. Okay. He'll walk over. He'll beat Crimson. Barely, but he does. And then we'll have berries work on this one. As for what he's going to work on, I think attachment. Let's go ahead and have him work on attachment. And then we'll work on Red Queen as we need to. Okay. Crimson can't die, even if she does take every single box of damage. So, I mean, that's a plus. Plus, we do get healed immediately after doing Festival. So, she'll be fine. Um, yeah. I'd say the hardest thing... Oh, right. And then we need Joy to come down here to do crumbling armor. So we'll have Marcos uh, swap places. Okay. So we definitely have what we need to do in store, even though it is still going to take a little bit of a hot minute. But that's okay. So we'll have Joy come deal with this. Right, she's no longer at the bottom. That's going to take a little bit of adjustment. Um... And then we do have the Green Dawn event coming soon. So we'll have Joy pick up the heart. That way we don't have to worry about the meltdown over there. And then if she suppresses something, she can also still work on crumbling armor. So overall, I think this is going to be pretty solid. Um, it is going to take a little bit of finessing, but that's okay. Okay, Joy, come get the heart preemptively. Don't. One day a question went through my mind. Okay, let's have Joy come deal with this. And then people who are currently free. I want... Ayan will deal a lot of damage. Um... Marcos takes reduced. And James takes reduced. That's what we'll do. She should be fine. Okay, we'll need to watch their health pretty closely. Um, okay, you're fine. Okay, Marcos is the one tanking currently, so... We'll let him take one more hit. Let's have him start backing out. Let's have a not a in start coming back in how are you doing up here joy's got it nice okay so i want joy to come over here to get a little bit of healing and then we can finish off this fight no problem okay james needs to start backing out change targets go back Ooh, marcos you should not be the one tanking uh yeah not in keep going in Ooh, okay. Start running! Oh my god, I don't know. I didn't know that he slowed. Oof. Whew. Okay, um, that was close. Let's have Unluckiest Man just come and finish this off. I do not want to uh, tempt fate, you could say. Uh, let's have Marcos come up here. Let's cancel work for the moment. Okay, uh, let's have James just take the long way back. Okay, yeah. So, James, you go ahead and, um, you just come back up here, bud. Whew, okay. <laughs> well, that certainly went well. Man, maybe we do need that extra healing. 
Oh, man, th there's a lot of buffs that I gotta tell you, I am missing. Like, for example, the hallway healing? That'd be nice. That'd be real nice right about now. I, uh, never thought I would be missing the hallway healing as much as I do right now. We're starting as level 3. That, uh, that's something I miss. <laughs> now, technically, we could have used this ring. Um, but I don't think we really needed the ring. The heart was really, really good to for Joy to 1v1 this. So that was a pretty good idea. Um, but as far as this goes, we didn't really need it uh, for this particular case. So, yeah, I guess now that we're sort of home free, we, do, we have to farm. Like, literally, we have to farm, considering we lost so many people. <sighs> okay. We caught up a little bit. <sighs> and, yeah, a little bit. But we did catch up. <sighs> Nobody died. So. Unluckiest man went from 64 to 68, 42 to 46, 40, uh, 52 to 58... Sombor went from 38 to 44, 33 to 48, 34 to 49, Joy went from 73 to 78, and 34 to 36. Ayan went from 21 to 22, woo. Marcos went from 15 to 17, woo. Berries went from 30, uh, went from 26 to 36, 42 to 52, 17 to 26, James went up by 1. And Crimson went from 15 to 46 and 15 to 32. So, all in all, we got a little bit of uh, catching up. You know, yeah, a little bit. Hyper-realistic Angela, engage! Business manager, what is the problem? Think. Can you please, I do not want you to lose. It is confirmed. There was a system error. It will not be easy for a foreigner to avoid compromises. It was first developed during the war and is now widely used in trade. This technique is very impressive. The human brain is very fragile. When you see dazzling and wasteful, you can inadvertently turn off your brain for a while. When the coach is like you, this reaction will be very difficult for me. Therefore, we have installed a meditation filter on the screen. The filter worker who died wor- Wait. <laughs> That's a confusing sentence. The filter worker who died working on the filter dollar looks like a cute red games are rare and affect your mental state by looking at them like a funny robot on screen. <laughs> Believe me, many of these managers managed to sit down with the cogni cognitive filter installed. She's got her eyes open. You will have. That's probably the most normal about has ever talked. <clears throat> During this time... No. During this time, James identified two abnormalities, killing three employees and four agents. As you know, this is a loss of many mistakes, and the laughter of all four lost two generals. And we lost it. Of course, for the example of James, he ordered. We know you don't need it anymore. Sorry, I could not stop them. Sorry for his personal relationship. I cannot escape the lack of care. Conversation, games. So it's nice. James the Clown. <laughs> oh, James, you're getting called a clown by yes on of all people. He is also wonderful. Of course, I'm in love. I are playing a draw. He will not be very tolerant and will grow up with minor violations of the rules. <laughs> wait, <laughs> wait, what? <laughs> wait, 
<laughs> Bro. About had a kid? And it's James? James is about kid? The, the lore thickens. The lore is thickening. However, it was not worth the root of the billing error. A film about robotics. Everyday propaganda of my body. <laughs> it's a secret. Sometimes I feel sad and afraid that others do not want to share the work. Find friends. Managers, whenever they wonder that... <laughs> that is such a jumble. Managers, whenever they wonder what you, even you, I make mistakes too. See how to get rid of unrelated death. The angel is jealous. It really is a branch of a terrible monster. People say I'm wonderful. <laughs> yes, odd cold-blooded machine. Yes, odd snake. Hard and ruthless, yes, odd. Very cool creatures. Ah, oh, I'm like, oh. This is more Pluto than yes, odd. Oh, sorry, than about. Unknown to dozens of workers. Ah, no, that's even more Pluto. Oh, that didn't fix anything. Ugh, he's not Pluto. <laughs> God, wow, that's fitting. Hmm. He's listening to us. He can hear everything you say. He's listening. He's listening. He's listening. He's coming. He's coming. He's coming. <laughs> I wonder if I made anybody panic by doing <laughs> Because you know how sometimes people will like, they'll be talking and then suddenly they're like, I'm in your walls, 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 I'm in your walls. And like suddenly your fight or flight kicks in. I wonder if I, I, wonder if I did that to anyone on accident. I'm sorry if I did. Uh, it's natural to contradict his name. However, it will probably be more difficult than the built one. Sometimes I want to be a primary dimension without emotion. Undoubted faith can be considered lean. Yes, you are wrong. If you know that your own emotions are bothering you, the move to use AI to maintain your material. Do you know the answer? Okay, so. How do we feel? How do we think we're doing? Um, truthfully, not good, but... Life of a Daredevil, that is a really solid, like, red uh, resist. So what I'm thinking of doing, we're kind of decking Sally out to have hot, uh, not Sally, sorry, Crimson, to have 48. Uh, let, let, let me just try again. We're decking Crimson out to have high fortitude, high temperance, but low prudence. My reason for that, if she has low prudence, that means that she'll have the 50% chance with, um, you know, the cat. And, uh, hopefully that means good things. And with such reduced damage taken from red, I'm hoping that it'll turn out pretty dang good. So, as for who we're going to give the other super red resist to, um... Maybe Sombor? Yeah. Why not? We'll give it to Sombor. And we are pretty much good to go. We don't really have any new weapons. Um, unless we have want to have some more red weapons. But personally, I would like to keep our white weapons just in case anybody goes crazy. Oh boy. So, <laughs> let's begin day 10, I guess. Who do we who do we really want to farm up today? Um, Sombor might be able to take care of Red Queen. I don't know how much I trust that though. I would prefer Unluckiest Man sits on Red Queen for now. Sombor sits on Burb. Uh, Joy sits on Armor. And then I'm gonna have Crimson bounce between One Sin and Fairies. And then I'm going to have someone else bounce between one sin and fairies as she does. Because we want her to be essentially strong enough to deal with the cat. Um, with which, with this armor, 
and how we're building her, it's looking like we have a pretty fair shot, especially because we'll have a 50% insight chance. Um, we're giving ourselves as good of a chance as we can possibly get. Uh, it won't be a forever thing, because obviously as she keeps working on it, um, her insight will go up. So we only have one day, potentially, to max him out, and then we're just out of luck. So let's just really give her as much health as possible. Sally had 80 or so. So if possible, we want to get Crimson up to 90. That way, if push does come to shove, we'll still be fine. Oh, this doesn't feel great, but I mean, hey, at least we're using what we learned from that horrible loss, and uh, we're trying to make the best out of it, so. <laughs> Alrighty, so, unluckiest man <clears throat> wanted some bright pink hair. Now, I'm totally fine with doing that, however, um, they're all, there's only a few hairstyles that actually, like, we can make bright pink. So the ones I was debating between, because I didn't actually, um, I wasn't given a hairstyle. I was just given a hair color. And it's up to me to find a hairstyle that fits. So I was really thinking this one. I really like how this one looks. Um, however, there's not a whole lot we can do with hair in the back. So we're probably just going to go with nothing in the back, um, which means he is going to lose his ponytail. And me hovering off it got rid of it. Nice. So basically, um, rather than the purple hair, uh, he wanted the bright pink hair. I really think we're going to keep this one. I really like how this hair looks. Um, but the alternative would be this one. Or technically all of these. Um, or this one. Or there's another one. There it is. But this one, <laughs> this one makes him look like he's balding. Uh, so I don't really like that one. And then there is technically this one, but, um, yeah, I think we're just gonna go... I I'm torn between this one and this one. Like, the those, to me, look the best. Technically, this looks a lot more like... This would look better with something behind it, you know what I mean? So I think we're gonna go with this hair. Hopefully this is okay. Let me know if you want it changed, though, and uh, I will be sure to change it. Post-haste. Now, we want to make it as neon pink as possible, so I think, like, right there should be perfect. Unluckiest man is now the most beautiful-haired person in the corporation. Nice. You know, theoretically, I don't think, we, I don't think we're going to, but if Marcos Jr. would like... We could make him more like a magical girl. Because see the little ribbons? To me, this is like magical girl hair. Now, his eye won't have the signature cover over it. Um, but theoretically speaking, this is a lot more magical girl-like than uh, his current hair. But, uh, you know, whatever you want. I'm not going to change someone's character without them actually asking me to. But I am going to bring it up that if you wanted... This could potentially be um, the new Marcos hairstyle. Uh, of course, we have seen this hairstyle since he was made, so <laughs> it'd be a little weird seeing him without it. But um, you know, if you if anybody wants their hairstyle changed, be sure and let me know. Uh, I know the black hairstyles are a lot harder to see, but I tried to choose a hairstyle that I think suits basically everybody. A lot of people just have their hairstyle from the OG run. Obviously, the new characters do not, but for the most part, every character has, you know, the same hairstyle. The black hairstyle is so hard to see. She has two little pigtail things, because this is Myra, the uh, mad scientist from Ruina in Gibber's department. But anyway, um, we do technically have two more characters we can make. They would go into the reserve, so at the moment I'm just holding, um, and we'll see who gets added um, here in a minute. So yeah, all in all, it's going well! <sighs> Alright. 
I <laughs> am confident that Crimson can do this and not die. I'm confident and I want to believe. So, Crimson is on her way to the same place where Sally died to see if she can do what Sally could not. Well, she did do it. She did do it. Uh, by the way, we're definitely not doing Yes Odds mission today. <laughs> um, but she did do it. So, you know, that's something. If we just spam Prudence on this with Crimson, then maybe we can figure out a few things. However, there's equally the chance Crimson only has one shot at filling this guy out because let's say her prudence levels up after the end of today then she's not gonna be able to do it again so it, it's basic it's up to crimson the life of the daredevil um chest seems to give her enough protection to where she should survive the only way i think she would die based on her health and how many boxes are how many boxes she got and how many boxes you know she lost i would say crimson has to get at least two green boxes to survive she has to get two green boxes every time she works on him to survive because it was doing three damage consistently and if she only has five health then she would be at two health which obviously if she only gets one she's dead if she gets zero she's dead if she gets two or above she lives now we could also pick up the heart of aspiration because it does give us increased health However, we're not able to do that until we have the Dawn of Amber. Um, because we need... She has to fight something with the heart equipped. So that she doesn't immediately go insane by working on an abnormality. Also, the Dawn of Amber is going to suck. We... So, okay. Hodsimp, not Ann... And Joy cannot do the Red Dawn. Reason I say that, they take extra red damage. And um, I would prefer they don't die. Go. The perfect food. A perfect meal. An excellent substitute. Oh, Crimson, could you please gun these nasty little things down? I can't wait to fight those worms! Uh-huh, yeah, 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 sure, sure. <laughs> hey, buddy, you wanna go grab a coffee later? Oh, yeah, sure, I hope there's no giant worms in the uh, hallway. Ah! <laughs> oh, they're actually going to fight, though. Um, okay. I want... Sombor? Unluckiest man. You guys got this. And then Crimson. She's doing okay. Basically taking no damage. But see, even with her, with a Teth, um, with a Teth that only has 0 0.6 red damage taken, and the heart, look how much damage she's still taking. That is really, really high. Um... Okay, they're, they're doing okay, but I'm a little bit nervous about that. 
Okay, I'm actually, I'm gonna go have Crimson rest up a little bit. Even though she is doing okay, I'm just a little worried about it. I'd prefer not to lose anybody. Okay, you guys are doing decently. Try and finish this one off. Um, Crimson is on her way back to go rest. Okay, Sombor is starting to take a little bit too much damage, so let's have you run back and go rest. Okay, they ran, so I want you to come up here and go rest as well. Um, so where'd the other ones go? Did they all come to this room? Let's have, I want Crimson, come deal with this. Does, do we have anybody with a gun nearby? I mean, we do have Joy. I'd be interested to see how Joy does. Let's have Crimson turn around and shoot this one. Whew! Okay, Joy takes some damage, but... Jeez! Yeah, Joy takes some good damage, some good damage from that, but at the same time, god dang, she was doing like what, 18 pale damage? Whew. Yeah, that's pretty good. That sword is pretty good. Okay. So now uh Crimson is able to do more work on the freaking stupid cat lion. So, yeah. <sighs> because she has the heart, I think she can even fully fail and still be okay. So let's... Let's send her to go work on it. Although I'm not super psyched about it, but let's just go ahead and do it. She's full health at the moment. Okay. Okay. So, I noticed he was doing two to four. So, that is a little bit more damage than I would like, but at the same time, it... It does go to show she's actually managing. Um, still very, very scary. I definitely do not like it. But, I mean, it's working. So, guidelines. The amount of PE boxes produced differed if FO1, FO5, and FO1 existed within the facility. These three abnormalities were dubbed friends. Wait. Scarecrow, um, Woodsman, what's the third one? Gold Road? But I thought Gold Road was... Interesting. Okay. Maybe I misjudged what I thought was going to happen from this. I, I thought there was going to be... Okay. I mean, that's fine. I'm not, like, against the idea that it's actually way more simple than I thought it was, but... Um... Is that the reason he's so hard to work with? Because he, quote, quote, has no friends? Is that why he's completely destroying us? So, for example, if we had Scarecrow and Woodsman, would we be, like, maxing him out every time? That's an interesting thing to think about. Huh. I wonder... That, that's got to be it, right? Like, if his buddies are here, then getting an actually, like, good work result on him is much easier. That's got to be it. At the very least, that makes the most sense to me. I don't know how we're supposed to fully research this guy. This sucks. This is so terrible. 
one of the other results has to be better, right? Ugh. I, yeah, this sucks. Even with the heart, I mean, at the very least, we've seen she survived with, like, what? 20% health? I think for Crimson to die, he would have to hit for four every single box. He would have to hit for four every single box, and then I think she would die. Which, it seems like he's more likely to hit three than he is to hit four or two. So... Provided he doesn't kill us for doing the same work multiple times in a row, I think we've got this. It's just going to be a very long and tedious process. Um, actually, before anything else, let's have Berries come work on this. And then we'll have her come work on this, because... Aha! Uh -huh, yeah, that would be why. Yep. And then we'll have Joy come work on this. We'll have... We'll have Sambor try and get some repression. And, yeah. So this seems like it's going to be the strategy. Basically just keep sending Crimson in there to go do it. And hope that he doesn't completely high roll us. Like, for example, right now, he's actually doing a lot more damage than he has been the past few times. But those twos are kind of balancing it out. So even though it is a little bit scary okay so even if she only if even if she only gets one box she'll survive the amount of friends within the facility affected its work success rate if no friends were present within the facility it became extremely nervous and the work result rate was abysmal that is the case. Ugh. Okay. So that is what's going on. Because we don't have Scarecrow or the Woodsman, getting any progress on him is crap. So even though it says, like, I think Crimson has, like, a 48% chance on him or something. Yeah, 57%. So, it's actually, like, 7%. So, it drops by, like, 50 or 40 or something percent. So, that's why we're struggling so much with them. Okay. Okay. Well, we know that now. So, it might actually be worth it to grab, like, Scarecrow or Woodsman. I don't know. They're, they both kind of suck, honestly. Eh. <sighs> Or I guess Golden Road. We don't know what Golden Road does. Because Woodsman, you need a specific stat to work on. And then Scarecrow, you need a specific stat to work on. But Woodsman just flat out kills you. Whereas Scarecrow will just kind of wander around and become a mega meat shield if there's any clerks around. So, eh? It's like... There's... Yeah, mm. Man, Sally had to die because this stupid cat was just like, I have no friends! Wee, wee, wee! And then, of course, because Crimson is a lot more... Well, this hallway describes Crimson. Uh, she's able to work on him relatively easily because she just doesn't care. She's like, oh, you're nervous? Oh, that must suck for you. Whereas Sally's probably like, oh, you're nervous? Here, let me pet you. And then her face gets ripped off. <sighs> I'm not upset that she died. You're upset. Everyone's upset. Okay, so at least she's doing it consistently. But, um, yeah, progress is absolutely horrible. So, I don't know. Let's just, at the very least, let's try and max out ab the management tips and the work preferences. Let's try and just get that maxed out so that we can get the extra speed and the extra 4% success chance. Because that extra 4% might go a really long way. When a friend breached containment, it breached with them. 
<sighs> Regenerated all injuries sustained at extreme speed if any other friend was still breaching. Oh. Wonderful. I hate you. Oh my god. <sighs> I forgot to take the bracelet off. Oh, I forgot to take the bracelet off. Well, this one was just completely my fault. Uh... Well, alright. <sighs> God dang it. I, j I was so busy trying to micromanage everybody else and I just... completely forgot about the stupid bracelet. <sighs> alright. Add another one to the list, I guess, and make sure I don't mess that up again. Uh, we don't have very much new here. Um. Ah, goody. And as the heart is put away, we finish the day. After. Ah. <sighs> Okay, well, we have an extra 4%. Woo! Okay, well. Could have been a better day. But we still tried to make as much use out of it as we possibly could have. So, unluckiest man went from 68 to 74, 46 to 58, 58 to 67. Sombor went from 49 to 50, 29 to 48. Joy went from 78 to 89. And apparently her justice went up by one level. Not Aeon went from 22 to 53. Berries on Vines went from 36 to 53 and 26 to 69. Nice. James went from 15 to 19. Kyle went from 15 to 38. And Crimson went from 46 to 51, uh, 15 to 25, and 32 to 39. Why did you despise us so? There was a record. Nah. Is this a new one? Why did you despise us so? I don't recognize this one. <sighs> okay. Er. Yeah, I think this is a new one. I don't recognize this one. <laughs> Percent! <laughs> Who's there? Are you reading this? Who is the other? You can be. <coughs> Experienced anyone. Oh, what was young this character's voice again? Oh, it's so difficult to do that. To do a younger version of this character's voice. Experienced anyone. Experienced anyone who knows a lot about the company. It was not up to you to reveal the identity of the verb. He said, I tell you the truth. I want these three things to go to him. What do you think about the company that hired us? I want to say, I will ask you something like that. The job you prefer. The job you prefer? Yes. This is. Therefore, I cannot say whether this is true, but to speak. Many do not know anything about the company. I was wrong. Whenever I speak to you as soon as possible. I'm here to end the conversation. The risk of long-term contact with humans. That makes... <laughs> And so, <laughs> hmm, that takes the story in a whole new way. <laughs> I'm here to end your conversation with humans. Hello, manager. 
I'm in charge of the training team. Are you thinking of opening up my department today? Yes, we need it. All oh, the day before we got Hod, Hod Simp died. Ugh. Memory repository. God dang it. That is so annoying. Uh, put Mal over there because that's Mal's like normal spot. Ugh, I'm so frustrated. Oh well. Okay. Um, wing beat and colored paper. And then for weapons. Um, Pentians and Wingbeat. That should be fine. Okay. <sighs> so, because of the very little that we learned about how this thing works, we could just spam repression on it and potentially get the same results. Um, I want to use this but I don't know if that'll work and I don't feel like getting more people killed um, as for armor Mal is going to be out of luck and just end up using Pentience and Wingbeat so Mal unfortunately gets the worst suit but that's alright now we do have quite a few characters uh, who we have not made yet we have Five characters in the reserves. So that's pretty good. That is pretty solid. Um, yeah. Okay, I want to get a look at this abnormality. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh, it's another AG, bro. Come on. Uh, this is gonna suck. <laughs> this is gonna suck. Oh boy. Um. Well. Okay. <clears throat> A couple new people have joined us. Sarah has now come, uh, for the first time, technically, <laughs> back to the corporation. Yukari, who has a little bit of an updated appearance, mainly in the eyes. Sam, who has never appeared here before. And M. Annabelle, who also has never appeared here before. And just remember, if you want a character of your own to appear in this series, be sure and let me know. Um, I preferably would like to not just randomly add characters um, from original L Corp or Ruina if you guys don't want them here. So be sure and let me know if you want a character here. And I will be sure and add them when the time comes. Oh, good. Dawn of Amber, Noon of Crimson. I actually would have preferred the Noon of, uh, uh, where the pillars drop. Oh, well. Okay. <sighs> So we know this is an HE. So do we think Okay, in the base game, insight is winsight is a motto that I developed for new abnormalities. Because insight just won. So Oh no. Okay, um, I'm still doing it. Insight is win sight. Well, they're kind of creepy. Okay, here we go. Piece of cake. Unluckiest man feels as if his energy is being drained of his body. Uh, blah, 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 wishes for grief to be absolved. He feels pain. His chest is being crushed. Huh! Inside is Winsight. What can I say, boys? 
4, 8, 12, 16. When the employee finished work with another abnormality, the counter decreased. When the insight when the insight work result was good, the counter increased. Upon finishing repression work, the counter dropped. When the Quiploth counter reached zero, the hallway the abnormality was in flooded with water. Employees attempting to traverse the flooded hallway had heavy white damage dealt to them. <sighs> At least they're in a pretty good spot. The door is relatively easy to, like, access. So provided this doesn't kill us, let's just send Unluckiest Man back immediately. And then as soon as he... Well... Oh, this kind of sucks. We have to deal with Punishing Bird and these being unhappy. Mm. What in the world? Inside is so good! <laughs> Inside is so good! Listening to the woes through absolve work set the counter back to full. However, the prudence of the employee who undertook the work was halved for the rest of the day. Oh. <laughs> okay. Don't do repression. Attachment is a big maybe. And insight is winsight. Okay. Well, this doesn't seem too terrible. I mean, it's manageable, provided we don't just die. However, we actually... So if we work on Punishing Bird, the counter goes down. And then we do Insight, and the counter goes back up. Right? So, theoretically, this won't be that big of a problem, actually. The biggest problem is going to be the Noon of Crimson. I don't know how we're going to deal with that. Um, we can barely... Well, with a little bit of planning, we can barely deal with the Dawn of Amber. How are we supposed to deal with the Noon of Crimson? Here we go. The Harmony of Skin. We march from time to time. Oh boy, here we go. I'm scared. I do not like it. Oh, I don't like it. Is it only the one? Okay, we only have to deal with one. So... Crimson, Joy, Sombor. However, I want Crimson to tank. And now I want Joy... Actually, how are we going to get them behind... You know what? New plan. You guys come in here. Crimson, lead them in here. Okay, he's fighting the clerks. Okay, get ready, get ready, get ready. Here we go. Ah! Uh, hang on. Okay. Let's have Crimson walk this way to start tanking. Is that AoE? How's everyone's health? Um, yeah, Crimson's taking damage. Go figure. Uh, Joy's okay. Sombor's okay. Unluckiest Man is okay. 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 I want Crimson to start running back to heal. Okay. Here come the dolls. I call them dolls, but they're whatever they are. Um, Marcos and not Anne, I want you to go for that one. And then James. Joy won't get there in time, will she? Well... Let's see. Maybe they will. Okay. 
you four go for that one. Where'd the other guy go? Ew. Oh, I didn't even realize that there was another one. Oh, that's bad. Oh, that's real bad. Um, let's, oh man, who has our highest white? Joy does. Um, Joy, I need you to go work on the Drowned Sisters. I'm sure you'll be very, very pleased about that. Here comes the water. Um, I'm a, uh, mm, I don't want to lose Joy, truthfully. Joy's our best fighter at the moment. Mainly because of the Pale Sword, but still. Um, so it's, yeah, oh, he died from the water. Okay, well, let's see if we can stop this guy. There, done. Um. Hmm. The door's right there. I'm really curious if she can make it. Oh, they took so many points! We were at like a hundred! Oh, I was saving up for the weapon and they stole points. Ugh. Okay. Joy, let's see if you can do it. Seven. I think she's got this. Whew. Just had to hold your breath, huh? Minus 42! Does she only have one prudence? <laughs> she only has one prudence! Oh my... Okay, well, I can tell you what she's not doing for the rest of the day. Anything. She gets to have the day off. Ugh. Okay, at least we got through that without anybody dying. That's better than I can say for the previous few days. <sighs> well, they're kind of cute, by the way. Um, sure, they're drowned and blue because they're probably waterlogged but you know what they're kind of cute um as for their gift and stuff uh at well actually huh joy actually could really benefit off this considering she's our fighter and it's a helmet it get rid of the fire oh that's so good Oh, that's actually amazing. We can get rid of the fire. Which means she can actually start doing repression work again. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Not to mention, it's just a really solid plus six, plus six. And then, here's the plus four. So, it's just a free plus six, plus six. That is going to be legit. <sighs> Unlike the cat, this day has gone extraordinarily well. So, ah, uh, yeah. Also, we might have done Yesod's quest. Not sure. We did Yesod's quest. Nice. Okay. Unluckiest man went from 58 to 86, 70, no, 67 to 69. Nice. 44 to 45. Sambor went from 44 to 55. 48 to 65, 50 to 59. Joy went from 89 to 93. And 37 to 41. Aeon went from... Not Aeon. Went from 34 to 54. Uh, Marcos got a whopping 2. Berries on Vine went from 53 to 62. And 52 to 72. James got a whopping 1. Kyle got uh, 38 to 50. 15 to 28. And 15 to 38. Crimson went from 51 to 64, 25 to 66, and 39 to 50, and Myra got a whopping one. Um. Is this old lady?
This one is um, the sheep, I think. I think this is like the sheep thing. I don't remember the sheep being all that bad, but oh boy. So old lady, sheep, and then the uh, pleasure flower. I'm trying to think, what what do they give? She gives like the revolver. Um, this is like the black damage that has a white dot. And then I think this is just like a long range white weapon. Is this the bubbles weapon? No, that's that's the shark. I think. Um. Ooh. Honestly, I'm kind of debating just taking grandma. Well, but we already have two that, like, need to be focused on or else they react poorly. So maybe not Grandma. Maybe we take the Dreams. I don't know. I mean, we could take Pleasure Flower. I don't think Pleasure Flower is actually all that bad. It escapes, but it'll be our first escaping abnormality. Technically. But having, having that dot, honestly, though, okay, let, let's do this. What do you think? Anger. You have seen something that is missing. You cannot ignore freedom of speech. <laughs> what? what? I'm not. But football is there. Now, are we talking about football or football? Because they're two different things, Angela. You, your freedom of speech can't run me for loops. It's supposed to be an annoying consumer <laughs> Consumer sauce! <laughs> okay. <laughs> Did we? <laughs> That's the first I'm hearing about it. We had a serious discussion. And they felt uncomfortable talking to me. Probably because I'm a good creature. Unknown to us, we envy and nothing can do. In addition, advanced artificial intelligence is... Wow! Oh! Uh, aren't you angry? I PM general and head of the training team. <laughs> God dang it! Mm, it's so bad! What? Uh, this is what we are trying to find a company that happens there. But if it is said that the Angel of the Rod, Abraham, took initiatives that made almost half of it, that accidents could be prevented. I... I, like, need a minute to even process what was just said. <laughs> that made no sense at all. Thus, group training and education is provided by the main operational staff. As you know... This does not reduce the number of treatments. Anyone who wants to move to another department helps to adapt to the new job. That was like... That... <laughs> did somebody... Did someone just speak coherently? That's insane. Kappa is the best character, and this is why. This sentence right here. Look how long the sentence is. And she pretty much got it 100%. Well... I'm not very good at many places, but I try not to get in the way. In fact, I recently tried to design a TV. I wonder if there is such a need, but also... Want to know about the program? To find out the benefits in your business is high, despite the constant audits. <laughs> uh, there's... look, there's a lot of bit... look. Business is booming. There's benefits all over the place. Yeah, we're getting audited all the time, but we have investors. <laughs> oh, yeah, what, yeah. I think so. I will know the cause. However, I have never had direct contact with the abnormality. They know what it means to lose yourself. I do not know if my staff likes the new plan. Will help not eat. Will not help. What? 
Let's try that again. I do not know if my staff likes the new plan will not help either. <laughs> knock it. Do not knock on the door. <laughs> muslin? Oh, muslin. Oh, muslin, muslin, muslin. What can I say about you? Oh, what a good name. At least it isn't about or kappa. Thank you, Mrs. Alliance. He has spoken to many, but I suggest I feel better. Eventually got rid of any bad eyesight. My thoughts are quite good and too many. No, not at all. I will answer your question. It tells you how to get started. I mean, work if you can get addicted. However, Dianyo, you really saved a life. I am very happy that it is my Sephra. Very nice. <laughs> <sighs> Thanks to Tiffany for the treatment. Hopefully you will now move to a different consumer. Do not forget our conversation. Of course, and I do not want to do that. Director, did you see that? Does my program really work? Kappa has like, she talks so normally. She's the normal one. Oh my goodness. It's so, look, it, <laughs> I just imagine X. It just, just like holding Kappa by the shoulders, just giving her like a, a little shake, practically crying. You're the only normal one here. You're the only one I can understand. Oh. <laughs> just practically crying, and she's just like, uh, do it the big sad. <laughs> oh yeah, this is good. I like this. I want my work to be useful to people. The need to do more and more things in life. Okay. Once a day, when commanded to move during suppression, move to a specified location with all entities within the vicinity. Huh? Okay, hang on. So once per day, when we try to move, we will teleport everything in the room with us to another room. That's one way to guarantee a good farming room. Prudence of five? Jeez, does anybody have that? Four. Um, two. Yes, unluckiest man is the only one who has it. I guess he's using grief. Uh, likewise. He's the only one who can use this. Well, there you go. <laughs> so be it. Um, then we gotta re-equip some stuff. Or no? Not really. Um, I kinda want Sarah to have a white weapon, if I'm honest. So... Yeah, everybody's pretty much just automatically equipped. Um, I definitely don't want that being visible. That just looks dumb. However, I will keep that helmet. That is a nice helmet. Oh boy. <laughs> okay. So. I think that is going to do it for this episode of the Lobotomy Corporation. Thank you guys so much for watching. I know it might feel like a little bit of a shorter one. At the very least it does to me. But I think it is probably for the best. So that we don't completely lose our mind. I'm going to put Wingbeat here, and Wingbeat there. Okay. So yeah, all in all, we are doing pretty good. Progress is, overall, pretty solid. Ugh, having to make some real questionable plays. But, uh, that's okay. So thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know if you want a special character in this series or if you want your old character to be in this series and I will be sure and add them post haste. Bye.